We may still be 18 months away, but preparations have already started for the 2013 Senior Games, which will take place here in Cleveland. News Channel 5's John Kosick spoke with event organizers in town this week, doing a little advance work, huh, John? That's right, Danita. When you're looking at organizing events for 14,000 athletes competing in 19 different sports, you need to start early. Tonight, many of those behind the games are getting their first look at Cleveland. In downtown Cleveland, they gathered tonight more than 100 representatives of the National Senior Games in town from across the country to begin down the road that will eventually lead to this, Cleveland's hosting of the 2013 Summer National Games. This is a chance for all of their 50 state representatives and multiple from each state to see Cleveland, feel what it's going to be like, and this is a group that's going to help us recruit 12, 13, 14,000 athletes that are going to be here next year. And to put that number in perspective, this event will have more athletes in 2013 than the Summer Olympic Games will be in London in 2012. It's that big, and they chose to come to Cleveland. And they chose Cleveland over 21 other cities that bid for the games that are expected to have an economic impact of $35 million. On top of that, the timing of the senior games is great for the city, which will look a lot different in 18 months than it does today. The investment in the Medical Mar Convention Center, the casino will be open. We're also expecting the Flats East Bank project to be open. So there will be many things that will be happening at the same time. The hope is they like what they see and aren't shy about saying it. So we're going to have 35,000 ambassadors coming to town, and these are people who should be going back telling their family and friends that they ought to come to Cleveland to visit, to move, to start their businesses. It really is huge for us. Now, to compete in the senior games, you have to be at least 50 years old. Cleveland will get a warm up of sorts this summer when they host the Ohio Senior Olympics, which serves as a qualifying event for those senior games. On your side, John Kosick, News Channel 5.